Hey guys, this is Chris with AOUsers.com and today we're going to do a speed test on AOL Wireless's network, which is the same as AT&T, in Houston, Texas, inside my house, which really doesn't have that good of a signal uh, on the HTC One. This is the AT&T version of the HTC One. First, we're going to go ahead and run a speed test uh, with the AT&T SIM in. You can see a ping time of 52 milliseconds. Download speed of 10,591 kilobits per second down and 10,289 kilobits per second up. Definitely not the highest achievable rates uh, in Houston. Not going to see that at this location. In the future, I will be doing speed tests from different locations to give you an idea of what this can top out at. Let's go ahead and pop in the AO Wireless SIM. In the Galaxy S4, we actually didn't have to go change the APNs. It was really, really simple. Um, the required parameter changed on its own and the required parameter was the MMC it changed to 150 you can see we have 4G LTE like we did with AT&T SIM let's launch speed test again hit try again begin test As you can see here, the ping time was higher, 228 milliseconds. Download speed, slower at 7,197 kilobits per second. And upload at 7,168 kilobits per second. So even when you're not throttled on AOL Wireless's network, it looks like it'll come in a little bit slower than an AT&T subscriber. But for most users, uh, this will help you stream media, uh, do everything you are required to do on a normal day with a premium smartphone device without a contract and easy nice rates uh, to pay every month so for more information on this and more please like this video subscribe to this youtube channel uh, you guys the watchers are what allow me to uh, purchase these accounts and do these tests so thanks a lot